Good morning everyone, my name is Damien Levy, I'm a forex trader since 7 years now and this video is a beginner course to chart mastery. Why learning to analyze the chart? Any financial asset in the world have a chart to show the fluctuations of its price. Whether it is currencies, metal like gold, stocks, etc., chart analysis gives you information faster than the news. The big players have thousands of people analyzing the fundamentals of any market, and based on this huge amount of data, they decide where the market should be headed and invest accordingly. They are the one driving the price. We retail investors rarely get the info before it is too late, which means the good information that has the power to move the market will reach the retail investor way too late for him to take advantage. By the time we get the news, the market has already moved. But we can see the move of the price in real time and this is what we can use to profit. Because whatever fundamental element drives the market to fall or rise, well, if the big investors think it should, why not following the flow of investment and make money with them? And this flow can be seen on the chart. This is where being able to understand the chart quickly provides a valuable insight. In today's market, the candlestick chart is the most used, that's why I will focus on teaching you this universal chart type. Before that, I will introduce the two biggest markets worldwide, how to invest in them using what is called a broker. Today, we will learn what is the stock market and what is the forex market. Three safe brokers to trade with in the US and worldwide. What is trading and why you should know more. Demo trading and how to save your hard-earned money using MetaTrader 4 to trade, invest in the market, line chart and candlestick chart presentation, the angle thing, only candle you need to know, composition of a trade, entry, stop loss and target profit, limit and stop order types, placement of a trade with a simple profitable strategy, and finally, smart money concept presentation of the next video. Thanks for your patience. A lot of videos are coming. Kindly subscribe and click on the notification bell to receive alerts whenever I publish a new video. What is the stock market? The stock market is a market like the one where you buy vegetables and fruits, but this is a market where we can sell and buy shares of companies, commodities or indices. Supply and demand. The price of those assets is constantly moving up or down, pushed by supply and demand. When there is a lot of supply, equal sellers, the price will fall, because there is not enough buyer to meet the price. And when there is a lot of demand, which means buyers, and not enough of sellers, then the price will rise to meet the demand. Structure. To invest in the market directly, it requires a lot of money. So we use a broker that will gather a lot of orders and place our trades into the market directly. Join my student, let me guide you to become profitable faster and save your hard-earned money. The contact is below the video. What is Forex? Forex means foreign exchange. It is a currency worldwide market. When you go on holiday, for example, and you exchange your euro from peso, you use the forex market. When you buy a home in a foreign country, you are also using the foreign exchange. If you invest in business abroad. So the forex is a worldwide interbank network. National banks create a network between them and this network is the base of the forex market. This market is open 24 hours, 5 days per week. 
To simplify here, market starts with New Zealand, Australia and Tokyo. Then when the Asian market close, London and the other European markets open. Finally, at midday London time, we have the US market that opens. Then when the US market close, the cycle starts again in Asia. It is closed on Saturday and Sunday for retail traders. Advantages compared to the stock market. The stock market is open only during working hours of the specific country or continent where it is, which means you can trade the shares of the businesses that are proposed by the stock market only 8 hours per day, 5 days a week. The forex market being open 24 hours, 5 days per week provides us 3 times more opportunities to trade. You can trade at any time of the day from Monday to Friday. Comment below, tell me what video you'd like me to do. Manipulation. Retail traders represent only 9% of all the volume in those markets, which means the big institutions have the power to move the market wherever they want. Their goal is to harvest our money and they are pretty good at it. Happily, some people have leaked how they do it and how we can make money along them. I teach you all about it in the Smart Money Concept course. Financial vehicle. To trade in Forex, we invest in currency pairs compared to shares in the stock market. The first currency in the pair is called the base currency. The second currency in the pair is called the quotation currency. It is this way because we need to compare one currency to another to determine its value. For example, to determine the value of this pair, we use one unit of the base currency and we ask how many of the quotation currency is necessary to make one euro in this example. As of today, for example, we need 1.13 dollar to make one euro. So the value of the euro USD pair is 1.13 dollar. For example, to determine the value of this pair, USD yen, we use one unit of the base currency and we ask how many of the quotation currency is necessary to make one USD in this example. As of today, for example, we need 110 Japanese yen to make one dollar. So the value of the USD yen pair is 110 yen. Why price moves? Like explained with the stock market, in Forex 2, there is always a fight between supply and demand, buyers and sellers, or bulls and bears. Now, for currency, what are the elements that influence the investor to put their money in a country or to leave it? Those elements are, for example, the unemployment rate, the production of the country, the import compared to the export, the interest rate of the national bank, news events like election or big political events like the Brexit where the UK was leaving the Europe, or again natural disaster. Time during the day for better trading. As you know, the entire day is composed of three major sessions. Asian, Tokyo, Sydney, then Europe, and finally US, New York session. The two first hours of each session are the times the moves starts. And this simply means that you don't need to stay in front of your computer the whole day to trade successfully. If you concentrate your attention during those two hours of each session, then you can just trade, let's say, two, four, or six hours a day, and that's it. If you need a mentor, I have created a one year long program with 70 plus lessons. I personally review your homework, I do live webinars in it, weekly analysis and signal with entry target and stop loss, security plan to avoid losing your hard earned money, and adaptation to your inner psychological trading style. And there is way more than that. This mentorship is in three phases, three courses, 
One based on methodology and psychology, the second based on trading concept, and the third based on how to pass a prop firm and become a professional trader, consistently making money from the market without investing a cent from your own pocket. The first is TD Ameritrade. It's a well-known American broker, regulated, and you can trade stocks, options, forex, and many more. The second is Oanda, with the same criteria. And the third is Forex.com. All of them are regulated and safe broker worldwide. Now, if you are outside of the US, there is a worldwide broker that I prefer to work with, and this is IC Market. So it is a well-known worldwide broker regulated in Australia and Seychelles. You can trade stocks, options, forex, and many more. The trading conditions are the best I have found so far, and I use them personally. The link of the complete review of them is below this video. Safe Brokers. Don't take my words for it, you can find those on Google or Trustpilot and you can also read many reviews on Forex Peace Army. My goal is to teach how to fish safely. From my personal experience, those are safe but things can change and the broker will always remain your personal choice. Follow my trade, join my Telegram channel to follow my analysis and follow my trade. The link is below. Why trading? Compound interest is the eighth wonder of the world. He who understands it earns it. He who doesn't pays it. First, how a trade works. So this is GBPUSD line chart on the four hour time frame. In this sell trade, your risk is equal to the red rectangle. And let's imagine it's equal to $20, OK? Your reward or target profit is five times bigger, which means $100. So this reward can be achieved when you learn, uh, for example, any smart money concept, you might eventually get five reward on average. So every trade that you will place, you will lose maybe, let's say, half of them. But the one that you win, you will win five times more than the one that you lose. So if you place $20 on this specific trade using a smart money concept strategy, you will get $100. You just have to win one trade out of five to be profitable. And this strategy makes it realistic to create 15% a month once you master your trading skills. And there is a specific methodology to accomplish that. Compounding. So let's imagine we trade a specific percentage of our account on each trade. And there is a tool using the trading platform that can help you to achieve that. It's very simple. And I give this tool for free. Every time our account grows, our size grows in value. So you will always use 1% of your account per trade. But if your account is, for example, $5,300, one trade will represent $52. But if your account is only $5,000, then 1% 1 will represent only $50. When you use this specific size, when you place 1%, you make 5% when you win a trade and you, and you lose 1% when you lose a trade. So when you do that, imagine, for example, something quite realistic. You get, let's say, 5 to 6 trades per week and you win 3 out of, out of 6 and you lose 3. The 3 that you win, you make 5% and the 3 that you lost, you lose 3%. So 3 times 5 equals 15% of your account, minus 3 equals 12% of your account. So you might be able to make 12% profit per week if you use 1% each trade and you get, let's say, 6 trades per week, which is completely realistic. And this will lead for 12% profit a week. Now, if you make it to a month, it might make 40%, but let's say for worst case scenario and realistic purposes, we'll, we'll reduce this 40% and let's imagine we can make 15% profit per month. And this is completely realistic when you master the trading skills. So this is what will happen if you master your trading skill and you can make eventually 15% per month. We start an account of $5,000. With a 15% growth per month, we can multiply this account by six in a year. 
See, you started with $5,000. After one month, you get $6,600. After two months, you get $7,800. $7, and then after six months, you get $15,000. So you triple your account already in six months. And if you continue in this rate for 12 months, your $5,000 account will finish with $31,000. So this is really six times what you started with in one year once you master your trading skill and your strategy. The joy of a demo account. Each of those brokers propose a demo account, which means you can learn the skills of trading without the need to invest a single dollar. And this is completely free. Why using a demo account? So this is a diagram made by Trade City, well known in the industry, a very solid mentorship program. And this pyramid summarizes exactly how the traders fall into the trap. So first, all traders start with the dream to get rich quick, which is a dream. Then 40% trade only for one month. After one month, they just quit. 80% quit within the first two years and only 7% remain after 5 years. And the ones that remain and continue to improve themselves and work with perseverance in this field, well, those are the ones who make it on the long run and they make more money than you can ever imagine. 1% of all traders can profit net of fee. And that's the hard truth. This is not a game. You need to take this seriously. And you need to use a demo account to avoid falling into those trap. And when you are consistently profitable on a demo account, that's the only time when you will eventually invest a little bit of money or try to qualify in a prop firm that will give you a lot of money for a very, very cheap fee. Why traders lose their money? First, they don't educate themselves. Second, they take trading like gambling. Third, they don't master a strategy. They jump from one strategy to the other without mastering it. And they don't choose a strategy that really gives them an edge. Find out 10 proven strategy in my mentorship and some free on my YouTube video. But like any strategy that works, you will need to backtest it yourself to see with your own experience that it works. And after you will have to demo test the same strategy until you are consistent and are able to eventually double or triple your demo account. That's the methodology that you need to use if you want to be consistently profitable and be financially free with trading as a job. Trading platform. We will focus on the most used trading platform worldwide. Its name is MetaTrader 4. This platform is free on any broker. So some people will say, well, there is a MetaTrader 5. Why don't you use a MetaTrader 5? It's because basically the best tools have been developed for MetaTrader 4 and they are not updated on MetaTrader 5. So the 90% of the trader Honestly, use MetaTrader 4, not 5. And that's where you will find the most useful tools to trade profitably and professionally. This platform permits you to analyze and trade all assets available on your broker. It is easy to use, and I will give you a list of tutorials to learn how to use it at the end of this webinar. Chart analysis using MetaTrader 4. Let me show you now how a line chart works directly on MT4. Here we are right now on MetaTrader 4, and this is uh, this whole window right here is the MetaTrader 4. Okay, on top you have eventually the number of your account and your broker. So this is a funded account, and then after that you have the menu, file view, etc., and then you have the quick task bar here where you can change the time frame and everything. This is a basic chart. You have the axis at the bottom which represent time and then you have the axis, the vertical here which represent the price. So time goes in this way until here. That's where the price is at right now. And then the price is this vertical scale right here. We are on this specific chart on the one minute chart and we are looking at what is called a line chart. So the chart is just represented by 
a line up and down up and down that's a line chart this line chart will give you one value every minute so this is the time every one minute the chart will move one bar ahead okay so this is 40 seconds we will wait until zero seconds so you can see so this point right here was when the price ended at the end of the previous minute because we are on the one minute chart right here and as you can see as the price moves this line move and at the end of one minute this price will print a specific price and then move on to the next space of time here we go here we go so it printed this point right here that's the only value that you get from the line chart it's very little compared to the candlestick chart and that's what you get every minute it will move stop at a specific point, show print a specific point at the end of the minute and move on to the next pretty simple now we will talk a little bit about time frame so we are on the one minute chart and there is a lot of time frame right here there is a minute one minute five minute 15 minute 30 one hour four hour daily weekly and monthly chart and it's very simple to think about it and to explain to you that I will draw a rectangle. So I take the one minute chart and I draw a rectangle on the full screen. You see that? Now, to simply show you how time frame work, I will, I will go to the five minute chart. And you can see that the rectangle that was representing my full screen from the one minute, it was like that. Now it's only only on this little rectangle right here so it's like when you zoom out from the one minute to the five minute you will zoom out from the five minute to the 15 minute let's go in you see the rectangle gets more little then if i go to the 30 minutes this rectangle gets even more little so we are zooming out basically and this is a one hour and on the one hour you know this big rectangle that represented the whole screen just represents this little candle right here now we are on the one hour and i will take a rectangle and i will put it on the full screen of the one hour okay and this represents 139 candlestick okay so we have one hour on this candlestick on this chart one hour candlestick and we go to the four hour and the same happen so it's another zoom out but a very more powerful and then on the daily this rectangle is just this little right here then if we go on the weekly we can barely we can barely see the rectangle anymore from the one hour so this is a weekly chart and the one hour is very insignificant on it that's how time frame works and you can go from one minute to one month per per candlestick or per space time basically so let's come back to the presentation now let's look at the candlestick chart analysis created around 1700 by the Japanese trading master Homa it is the most used worldwide because it is pleasing to the eyes but more importantly because you can get four information from a single candlestick compared to the line chart how a candlestick works on the left is a bullish candlestick and on the right is a bearish candlestick the bullish basically the open is at the bottom then during the time one minute one hour one day it doesn't really matter the price will go up and at the end of the space time the price will finish at the top it will close above the open that's why we call it a bullish candlestick for a bearish candlestick, the price will start at the top and then at the end of the interval of time, it will finish at the bottom or below the open. And this will be called a bearish candlestick. On those candlesticks, we can also see two more information. And those information are the highest point that price was able to go to and the lowest point price was able to go to and those are called the weeks let me show you now how a candlestick chart works directly on MT4 
I will zoom into the one minute chart and in this specific chart a bullish candlestick is colored blue like this one and the bearish candlestick is colored white. So there is 30 seconds remaining, you can see, this will represent the close of the candle and it will move on to the next. You will see live how this specifically works. Here we go. So you see price switch from this minute to the next minute and this is the open basically, right here. Then price fluctuate up and down during these minutes. And depending where it will close, it will print a bullish candlestick or a bearish candlestick. And we will also be able to see on this candle where will be the high or the low. In this example, the low will be the bottom of this specific week right here. So here we are at the end of this candle and this candle will be a bullish candlestick as you can see. And from the information in this candlestick, we can see the open was right here. Then price went to the lowest point at the end of this week and then went all the way up and closed here. There is a possibility that there is a week on top and would, it would have meant that the price went above this and came back and closed here before going to the next candlestick. So out of one candlestick, you have more information than the line chart, as you can see. And this is very useful, especially when we look at the higher time frame chart. Okay, let's go back to the presentation. Most powerful candlestick. The bullish angle thing. Let's imagine you have three candlesticks going down and then price will print a very big bullish candle. This bullish candle, if it engulfs one or two candle, one minimum, this will be called a bullish angle thing. In a, in a bearish uh, angle thing, this is the example. You have, let's say, two to three candle, it doesn't really matter, going up. And then you have a big candle going down, engulfing the one or two previous candlesticks. This will be named a bearish angle thing candle. There is no need to learn all the different names of candles. The only one that works most of the time is the angle thing. Keep it simple. Focus on what works the most. And in this specific example, the angle thing is the only candle that work with a lot of accuracy. This candle is a bullish after one or more bearish of the opposite and will angle the previous last candle high and low. When this happens, the price has a high probability to continue in the same direction as the angle thing. Angle thing chart example. Let's see some example on the chart. Here we are. As you can see, you have several candlesticks going up and then after that, there is a big candle, bearish candle going down. This is a bearish angle thing, okay? After that, most of the time, price continue to fall. And remember with trading, you will not win all the time. Sometimes you lose and this trade is eventually a losing trade. Now, in this example, you have several candlesticks going down here. And then you have a bullish angle thing right here. And as you can see, after that, price continue to rise. Okay. Same happens here. You have one candle, two candle, three candle, quite little, one going down. And after price angle fit. And after that, price continue to rise. For example, price was going up with several candles going up. And then after that, price print a bearish angle thing. Then when price come in the middle of this candlestick, which is a very big one, that's why you want to wait for the middle, price continue to fall. Other example, price was going down with those candles. Doesn't really matter how many. And after that, there is a bullish angle thing right here and after price fly up. Other example here, price was moving up with those candle, little candle, and then after that it print a bearish angle thing, and after that price continue to fall. Other example, candlestick going down here, and then a big bullish angle thing right here, and after that a huge move up. This was a huge trade. Two last example, 
some candlestick quite weak going down here and then angle fit and continue to rise up let's go back to the presentation composition of a trade a trade is composed of three elements the entry point the stop loss and the target profits entry point here is the daily line chart on your usd so yellow line is the price history actual price right now is here right now you can buy or sell at the current market price or you can set a price where you will automatically enter the market by yourself when the price will reach those three ways are called your entry point stop loss same chart if you buy at the actual price for this specific example expecting the price to go up then you can place a stop loss to protect your trade this stop loss will take you out of your trade if the price reach it and if so it will be a losing trade it permits you to control how much money you can lose on each trade using it you control your risk and i would add you really need to use a stop loss target profit if you buy at the actual price for example expecting the price to go up then you can place your stop loss to protect your trade then you can place a third level that is called a target profit where you expect the price to go and to take automatically your profit there this target profit will take you out of your trade with profit if the price reach it and if so it will be a winning trade it permits to control how much money you expect to make on every single trade i advise you to always enter a trade where you can make two times or more your risk order types let's start with the buy limit so imagine the current price is right here you will place a level below the actual price expecting the price to bounce for it and this is called a buy limit order now another example is the sell limit so same imagine the price is the blue dot right here you will place a level above expecting the price to bounce from it and you will sell at this specific level the third order type is the buy stop this is a continuation trade the two first the limit order are bouncing trade okay now the stops are continuation trade so the actual price still the blue dot you will place a level above it and you will buy expecting the price to continue to go up that's called a buy stop on the sell stop it's the opposite the current price is right here you will place a level below the actual price and you expect the price to continue so you want to continue to sell and this is a sell stop order those are the four main type and the two more are the market order where where is the price imagine the blue dot right here you can buy or sell from the actual price that's the two last order types that are not in this picture and now we go for the bonus the placement of a trade and little strategy so this is the rule of the strategy we place the order with the tool easy order to simplify your trading the easy order tool there is a video on my youtube channel where you can watch how it works it's a very simple tool that will simplify your trading very important and compute automatically the size of your trade so you can stick to one percent of your account every single trade then we follow a set of rules for the strategy the rules of the strategy you follow the weekly trend then you place a level of support and resistance so same there is a lesson of support and resistance in this youtube channel just watch them enter at the end of the engulfing candle once price touches the level so price touch the level first and after that create an engulfing candle and that's when you will enter the trade you take two times your risk as a target profit we see this on the chart 
I will teach you a strategy five times more powerful in the smart money concept course where you will get five times what you put at risk on every single trade that is successful of course and you will win half of the trade most of the time 50% win rate and this strategy will be for the smart money concept but for this one which is the bonus of this video we just use a simple strategy a profitable one and let me show you on the chart how it works here we are on GBPUSD and this is a weekly chart so on the chart basically we define the trend so the trend basically is a succession of lower high and lower lows in this specific example and what we look for is a level of support and resistance so we'll scroll back and what we can see is we have a huge zone of support and resistance right here okay so we extend this level on the right side and basically we will zoom in a little bit right here and when the trend make a new low go higher and we use yellow as a color it's better and then break down okay break this zone what you expect is the price to come back to this zone and to sell in this zone aiming for two reward minimum now when the trend change so when price go down and then finally go up and break this zone the trend is an uptrend now we still want to use this zone and we will buy inside this zone so we will buy eventually here or here okay so I will show you. So you define your trend on the weekly chart and you place a level of support and resistance from the weekly chart and the link for the video on support and resistance will be below this video. And then you zoom for the forward chart. So now we will zoom and see how those trade unfolded. So here we are zooming on the forward chart and price broke our zone okay this zone is broken so now we wait for the price to come back to the level and then we want to sell and we wait for an angle thing so this zone price came right here touch and finally create a bearish angle thing this one right here okay when it takes this angle thing you basically sell at the bottom of the angle thing stop loss just above and you take two reward and this one was a beautiful winning trade okay then price come back to the level so once it touch one time you don't take the same level so you wait price to go more inside this level and once it goes there you have another angle thing this one is not an angle thing right here because it doesn't angle the top of this one okay so the only angle thing you get is this one so when this angle thing prints from here to here, then you sell and you take two reward again. And this one is also a winning trade. Just following the weekly trend, placing a level of support and resistance, waiting the only candlestick that really work in the market, which is the angle thing, and you get winning trades a lot. Now we took this zone already two times, so that's enough. Now we wait for this zone to be broken up. That's what happened right here. Price break above it right here so this zone is now broken and what we want is now price to come back to give us an angle thing in this zone and then we buy so price leaves the zone not really anything and then it come back right here price come here and print this beautiful bullish angle thing right here and this one the two reward is smashed in only four hours and this one made actually one two three four five six reward so if you place one percent in this trade you make six percent on this specific trade and all of the trade were winning trade huh? remember we took two trades they were winning with two rewards so you make two four percent and six you made already ten percent in your account with one currency just using one level and a simple weekly strategy and then price come back to the level but i don't know if it make an angle thing right here there is no angle thing here See, in this zone, price went there, but there is no bullish angle thing, so you don't have an opportunity for enter here. So this would have won, but you don't have any, any entry here. So that's basically a simple strategy. With this simple angle thing strategy from the 4-hour chart, not below that, because the candlestick, the angle thing candle is very powerful from the 4-hour chart and above, but below that, it, less, it is less and less reliable. So if you apply this strategy using the weekly trend, a weekly level of support and resistance and then a four hour angle thing candle you will be profitable 
just applying this strategy properly all the time. Smart money concept. Check the free webinar next video to discover how the market is manipulated, how to avoid the traps of the big money, and finally how to join their move to make highly profitable trades where you usually win five times what you put at risk. If you apply the proper methodology and the right strategy, your potential is in trading is limitless. I have seen some mentors selling this concept for more than $25,000, just so you can imagine how powerful this knowledge is. Catch my next video next week. This is the end of this video. Thank you so much for watching. I hope this beginner course helped you. Bye everyone.